Hi, my name is Janelle and this is my Nollywood Diary. When I saw the trailer of Quam's Money, I was super excited. I knew I was in for a treat coupled with the fact that Chinasa Onuzo, who is a fantastic writer, wrote the script and Kayode Kazum, who impressed me with Sugar Rush and unfortunately not so much with Kambili, the whole 30 years, was the director. Plus, it had fouls in it. I knew all my sorrows would be wiped away with his English. <laughs> Quam's Money is the sequel to the 2018 comedy drama, New Money. Do you remember Tone, a local tailor at the time? and girlfriend to Quams. Well, remember that her biological father, who she never knew, died and left her a whole lot of money. Yeah, that's it. In 2018, Files, who played Quams, won an African Magic Viewer's Choice Award and Vika for the movie New Money. Mm -hmm. Now, this time, the movie shifts attention from Tone and centers on the hilariously, seemingly stupid Quams, aka Kwame, aka Sweet Boy Q, who had hammered and is chopping life. His luxurious lifestyle put him on the radar of the triple B aka Boroboro Boys and was swindled smoothly and sweetly of 500 million naira. Quams felt being streetwise ghetto and also being a former security guard would get him his money back with a snap of his fingers. But did that quite work out? <laughs> in his bid to help, Quams' friend Rotimi took him to a cousin in the cybercrime force. But there he was told he could take up to two to three years to recover his money. This just burst Quams' head. He went loose and turned Sherlock Holmes <laughs> only for his stupidity or do I say naivety to land him into one trouble after another. He eventually came to a crossroad and was first to use as targets his ex-girlfriend Tone and then his friend wrote to me does Quams even have the brains to pull it off? <laughs> what could even make him consider such betrayal? Well, I really couldn't understand why billions of Naira had to be paid just to retrieve computer systems. It just didn't make any sense to me. It's not like they were sensitive documents. I sure expected to see them walk painstakingly on retrieval instead of giving up easy like that. Oh well, what do I know about computers? A lot. <laughs> if you're looking for something to elevate your mood and make you laugh, how Quam's money it is. Yes, Quam's was spitting funny lines the way he usually introduces himself <laughs> was hilarious. Who says my reputation is my CV, Quams. When the cybercrime lady said she'll be watching him, he said all oh, the ladies do. <laughs> Mado. <laughs> The dressing was on point, especially that of Tones. Her character was well represented. I like the way the Triple B planned the scam. It was so smooth and make-believe. The way they haggled the price, the Gabon accent and all. Oh my gosh, I love the way the story unfolded. The pretentious twists and turns were super, super amazing. Chinasa Onuzo always have the knack for dramatic revelations and taking us down a maze. Kayede Kasum, I like you back now. You're doing well. I give this movie a force star rating. What's your favorite scene in this movie, Quam's Money? Don't forget to subscribe your mail and our socials to stay abreast on Nollywood movies and whatnot. Stay safe!